Hey guys, Dan921 here. Welcome back to episode 3 of Time to Play Hearthstone. Oh yeah. I'm just going to go along with my hunter for a little bit. Just play with him. Um, as you can see, I've got 145 coins down, down here. Uh, when I hit 150, I will start, um, start an arena. And hopefully do not too not too terrible um, small disclaimer I am really rubbish in arenas um, and I can't really play them so yeah there'll probably be a lot of me failing um, versus yeah. so it's just a small warning but let's get on with this shall we so um, four twos I would have really liked a uh, one cast, but uh, one cost, but I think that'll do. Um, don't really know what my turn one play is gonna be. I don't really want to use a coin just yet. Um, it's actually quite good that I haven't got one because uh, the mage's fireball would just kill it. Okay, so she's chucking two taunts straight out. That's different I suppose. I think what I'm going to do is go for a turn two uh, companion. Put apple on your head. Okay that's going to be dangerous. So actually you know what? Ooh actually. I'm just going to do that player secret next turn I'm going to try and set up something unless he does attack and kills all of his creatures but if he doesn't I'm gonna set something up oh I'm gonna apologize for that because you just died and lost all of your creatures which is actually a huge advantage for me as I used one card to get rid of three of his creatures and now I'm just gonna play that what I was going to do is coin, um, then play uh, Starving Buzzard, and then my Unleash the Hounds, and then just like run them down. It was either, well, it was going to either be um, Starving Buzzard or Scavenging Hyena because there was three on the board, so that would have got me what um, eight, five, which would have been really nice. Um, strange that he used two cards to get rid of that, but okay. Let's see, shall we? Um, now I could play that, but the only problem is it's a 1-1 one, one creature, so he can just kill it straight away. Um, let's see, what can I do? I could play that and then that, but I'm I thinking he'll probably kill it. You know what? I'm just going to shoot him and let go. Uh, I know I didn't use two uh, mana, but you know what? Oh well. Card advantage is mine. Um, he's got five, I've got what, seven. So I'm quite happy with that. We have many secrets. And it doesn't seem like he knows how to play this because he keeps. Um, keeps. Like, Wasting cards like Crossbot. Why cast that on me? That should be more for creatures to control. Now, I don't know what secret that is. Um, it's either going to be a mirror image or something else. So I'm going to do that. Okay, so that didn't go, so now I'm going to put my turn down. And that will be my turn. Now I don't think he can actually hit my wolf with that, but I'm not sure. I don't I don't know if that Someday goes past taunts or not. So that'll be interesting. Ooh. Okay. You have just given me a 2-1 sheep, which I will be using to kill one of your minions. Like so. So that probably wasn't the best idea for you. What trap? Oh yeah, it's not. Okay, so um, I th 
think what I might do is do, do, do. Hmm. I might go starving buzzard no because it's only got one health no I'll leave it Just punch him in the face. not bothered if he if I lose um oh it was the ice barrier okay enough. That I'm not too bothered about. Now the reason I haven't really put anything out is because I'm waiting for a good combo. Yeah, I kind of figured he'd do that. So what has he got to play? Six damage fireball on me. That was a strange move, which means he's only actually got one fireball left, but I'm only at 13 health. So this... If he's got Pyroblast on turn 10, that could be very dangerous. Um, you know what? I'm going to get rid of that. I think then I'm going to put... Um, you know what? I'm going to put that and that out. See what he, uh, see what he thinks of that. Now next turn, what I'm thinking about doing is doing Houndmaster on the Hyena because okay, it'll get plus 2-2? Two two? Yeah, plus 2-2 two two and Taunt, so it'll be a 5-4, which will be very nice. And it means that he's actually got to attack that. Ooh, okay. Change of plans. I'm going to put that... No, I'm going to see what beast I get first. The 4-2 charge. In that case, I'm going to put that on him. And I'm just going to smack him in the face. Now, I probably should have put Starving Buzzard down at some point. But, the problem with that is, I didn't really have a taunt creature. And I'm, I don't know if his bat can go through taunts. If it can, I imagine he'll probably kill my hyena. Oh, that was a that was a shame. And that was damn. Um. Okay, I'm gonna do that and do that. Now I am very very vulnerable vulnerable to flame strike at the moment, but I want to get his health down quite low. No. Let's see what he does. Because if he flame strikes, that means I think all my creatures die. Because I think it, it either does two or three damage, I can't remember. It does four, so now it does five. That was, that was quite a good move. Fair enough. Um, doo -doo -doo. I think just charge and beast. And shoot him in the face. And then go and hit him for a bit more damage. So the difference is now I have card advantage and board advantage. Pretty much. Which is always nice to have. Go through down the swallowing as a freezing. Okay, so you killed that. That's got two health left. You're gonna do that and then hit him with that. Okay. No, you hit me. That was a strange thing to do, but that is perfect. I've got my um, high main. I'm going to shoot you in the face. I'm going to smack you in the face, and I win. Didn't realise I had lethal, but I do. So I'm happy with that. So I got the win. Yay. And I've also got the arena set up now, so I can go and do the arena. So, what I think I might do, actually... Um, how long have we been doing this? About 10 minutes? Um, you know what? I'm going to start setting my deck up for the arena. Uh, okay. Let's play this. Um, Thrall, Gul'dan, or Rogue? I'm going to go with Gul'dan. Uh, I like this person in the arena. Uh, I like the Warlock deck. Right. 
so he's got taunt but he destroys one of our mana crystals but that is a very good 3-5 character for turn 3 um, so that might be a, a choice that would be nice if I had a taunt um, like turn a creature into a taunt but I don't so I think the foul guard is going to be the best one um, give him a need to attack, deal two damage, or just have a two on charge. I think I'm going to go for the charge, the blue, blue girl warrior, that's the one. Um, right, taunts are always nice in a deck like this, um, because obviously I'm going to be using life tap quite a bit, probably, so I'm not going to have too much health. Which actually brings me on to this, because this is also a nice card to have. Because um, it can kill a creature and give me some health back, so that's always nice. Now, a Wisp, it's okay in certain situations because it's 1-1. One, one. So against a Major, Hunter, or a Rogue, it just dies straight away. But it is a zero-cost card for 1-1. One, one. Um... Although the Chillwind Jetty for 4-5 is always a good choice, so I think I'm going to go for that. Um, same with the Young Dragonhawk, 1-1, one, one, not exactly the best, so I think I'm going to leave him. Um, when all new minions dies, draw a card. I think I'm going to go for that because I'm going to need the health, uh, health restore. Many of you cast a spell, so I'm going to 1-1 one, one Violet. That, I'm not really going to have that many spells, so it's not very useful. First minion you play, each turn costs one less. So that is nice if you can keep it alive. And that isn't very useful to me. So I think that's going to be the one that I go for. Okay. Um, give it to minion to attack this turn. Abusive Sergeant is always a good, um, a good choice. Especially if you're lining up for a big combo. So I think I'm going to go for him. Um, when I'm in deck damage for a card. So that's good early game, but it's only got three health, so people can just kill it. Uh, Succubus is nice, but you get you have to discard a card. And I think I'm going to go for the taunt. Okay then. Um, give all the Murlocs plus two health, not very useful because I've only got the one. Demolisher, that is very decent if you can keep it alive again. Uh, swap the health and attack of a minion. Now that, that might be quite useful. Although I don't have a card to build up my health on a creature, so maybe not. So I think I'm going to go for that. Uh, whenever a minion dies, go on one attack. That could get very powerful if I can keep it alive. Give a friend a minion 1-1, one, one, that would be good for combos. An Archmage, it's 4-7 for 6, but you get the spell damage, and I don't really have any spells. So, Although Drown Life is a spell, and that would deal 3 damage. Um, no, I think I'm going to go with the Ghoul. Still full health to your hero, I think I'm going to get that one. Um, in Ranger and Wind Fury, is nice. Because um, you get the 4 attack and wind fury, so technically you get 8 damage. Uh, the spell damage is nice if you're using a caster deck, but I think I'm going to go for the 4 health to your hero. Um, that, not useful to me because I don't have a weapon. That would be nice, because you get a 2-4 and a 2-1 for 4 cost. But... That one's a 4 damage card, and if I'm in a tough spot, that would be very useful to use. Yes, I'd have to discard a card, but, you know, so be it. Um, I think I might get another Abusive Sergeant, actually. Um, yeah, I'm going to get another Abusive Sergeant. Uh, put two random demons for your deck. I don't have any at the moment, so that's quite pointless. Spell damage again, so it's going to have to be a mortal coil. Um, 
Flamming, that is nice for a turn one move. I mean, you've got the two damage, so it can't be killed straight away. Um, and you've got that three damage as well. Um, I think I'm going to go for that and try and not get any more ones because I don't really want any of them. Um, Fen Creeper or War Gollum? Although that's a taunt, that's a 7-7. Seven, seven. So that is quite powerful. And it's. If I'm in trouble like game, then that should be too good. That should be quite nice. Now, Knife of Core Hound is okay, but it can be killed quite easily. So, I think. I don't know. You know, I'm going to go for the Core Hound. Just because um, it'd be quite nice to have. So we've got a taunt. Taunt costs one less per attack of your weapon. That's not really very useful for me. And for a 4 3 3, it's not too good. Even though it has got taunt. Um, return a friendly minion to the battlefield, uh, from the battlefield to your hand. That could be nice with the abusive sergeant. If I can do it. Because, say so I've got a creature. Um, I'll play both of them, use that, call it back, and then play another one. That's, what, six health? Uh, six attack, so I think I'm going to go for that one. And it can also be used for other things. Um, that's nice, but it's a problem if I've got creatures out on the board as well. So I think I'm going to go with the um, the Demolisher. And then the Murloc isn't very useful. Um, another abusive sergeant. Should I go for it? I've got quite a few ones. I could do with getting some more twos, fours, and threes, really. Um, you know what? I'm going to go with it. Uh, Divine Shield, 3 1. Uh, it's got the damage, but not really got the health. But it can last two turns. Um,. I think I'm going to go for the Shadow Bolt. Another Abusive Sergeant. That is ridiculous. I would have four. I don't think I'm going to go for that. I think I might go for Night Blade. A 4-4. Four, four. I don't really have any 4-4s uh, four, at the moment. So, yeah. Um, that would be nice, but I've already got two sevens, so I'm going to leave it. Uh, another health would be nice, but... I think I'm going to just go for the warrior. Oh, a 5 for 7, 6, but your minions cost 3 more. That is good early game if you can get it out. Um, that's not very useful and that's not really that good. So, you know what? I'm going to go for it. Uh, silence minion, that is very useful. Um, always, always nice to have a silence. So I'll go for that. Um, Low order? Yeah, let's get one. Card draw is always nice to have. Um, might be nice to have another six. And that is a powerful creature. Yeah, I'm going to go for that one. So I've got two more cards to get. Um, I think... Uh, which one should I get? I might get the Fencro because I don't really have too many taunts. Um, yeah, I'm going to go for the Fencreeper. And, right, let's have a look at this. Destroy any, any minion damaged by this minion. That would be nice, but it's, you know, situational. Uh, destroy the minions either side of this after the minion... I think that's going to be the one I go for. Um, so, say I've got... Duh, 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 where are they? So I've got a War Golem and a Core Hound out. That will take the 7 and the 9 da attack and the 7 and the 5 dammy uh, health and put it onto this. So that would become a, such a powerful creature. That is a great for a combo. So I think that's going to be it for my deck. Um, and I think that's going to be it for this episode as well. 
uh, we've got a deck what I'll do is next episode I will jump into the arena and get going on that which should be quite fun so if you like the video leave a like if you want to talk to me leave a comment down below and hit that subscribe button as it really helps me out um, other than that have a good day I want to say thank you for watching and I shall see you next there next time